Hello everyone and welcome back to Hot Ticket. I'm Kevin Hornsby for Cox 11. If you've been looking for something for your young ladies to do this summer to get out of the house and get active, I've got the perfect guest for you. Coach Karen Barefoot from Old Dominion University. Thank you for being here. Excited. You know, as we tape, you are just finishing up a camp, but you have basketball camps coming up in July and August, which are a great opportunity. Tell me about how it's been so far this summer. Well, it's been a great, I mean, we went six days strong. We had day camp, then we had shooting camp and elite camp and uh, very positive turnout. We were mm -hmm. so excited about, you know, reaching and teaching. The Lady Monarchs were out there, you know, showing them how to play the game and it's for every level. Okay, so age group wise, you have the little, little girls out there just learning to play up through elite teenagers and so forth, correct? Yeah, I mean, 20 years ago, I started barefoot basketball. And, um, you know, when I wrote down the four things I believed in, it was learn, overcome adversity, visualize, expect nothing to give everything. And Kevin, when I wrote that out, each letter and each word said love. And, mm. I, and so it's always been my philosophy of, you know, I want them to learn every day because you okay. can learn a lot of things through the game. And I want them to understand that you can overcome anything by saying you can and visualizing what you learn, how do you apply it to what a team can do. And again, expect nothing, give everything. It's just about giving 100% and being a good teammate. Now, obviously through drills, they're gonna get better as a player and build confidence. But what's the team aspect do for you? I mean, what are they finding as they get together with other girls their age, the excitement? How's that going? Well, I am so passionate about giving back, and I'm from this community. And so for them, I, t I tell them, you could touch one life just by being out there, interacting with them, give them confidence, make them believe, and feel like they're, you know, they're somebody. And so for us, they enjoy it. And our players, they really get after when they're out there. They really are compassionate to those kids. Well, I've known you for a little while. In competition, your competitive nature seems to have always been at the forefront. So what is it like when your players, who these girls can see on television and see when they go to the games, step out on that court with them? Well, you know, for me to see them, you know, interacting with, with kids that maybe are getting into the game or, mm -hmm. or kids that want to go to college, you know, whatever level it may be, to see them just give their heart and soul to them, it, it really brings tears to my eyes because I tell them, I mean, they're a role model. You know, they, they are playing at a high level basketball. We're old dominion. Yeah. Um, and, and so for them to be able to have a strong voice and, and to be able to just have that interaction with them. They can walk out that door and be confident and accomplish whatever they want. Now the next camp we have coming up is going to be July 20th through the 23rd. Tell me, if, if I'm a parent sitting at home and have a young lady that's played a little rec ball or something and I'm thinking this might be good, what can they expect when they come to your camp? Well, we're going to have a lot of fun for sure, but we're going to work on things that are important. I mean, I think um, with today's uh, generation, I mean, they're exposed to a lot of different things like mm -hmm. video games, social media, things like that. So they lose that voice, that communication piece. So I'm working on leadership with certain drills okay. and also the confidence factor. I see a lot of head, heads down. And so I want them to be able to learn and be okay. And maybe you can't make every shot, but it's the next shot. Mm -hmm. or what can you do to help your team get better so it's you know just making them understand the confidence yeah. and I, I think that the biggest thing is the compassion part I want to see them care about each other I want to see them be a good team okay. I want them to you know go out there and, and you know everybody comes in with different backgrounds whatever it may be is be able to go out there and, and just accept each other and, and have fun and be mm -hmm. a team because really in life that's what it's about and we have another camp coming up in August, so there's uh, many opportunities for these folks to get out there. Now, you've been at Old Dominion how long now? Well, four years. I just finished my fourth year. As so head coach? Yeah. Okay, and have been an assistant. What's the culture like? I mean, you have one of the greatest facilities in college sports anywhere. The best. Yeah, the, the Constant Center is, I love going in there every single time we do something. But what's the culture been like? What's the crowd interaction been like supporting your program? It's, it's really amazing. Um, the compassion, the passion they have for Lady Monarch basketball. Um, it is definitely the, one of the best programs all time. Mm -hmm. We're three wins away from a thousand program wins. There's only that's, four schools that have ever done that before. That's phenomenal. So this year is going to be so yeah. exciting. Uh, we can't wait to reach that mark. And uh, this team is really, really working hard in off season to get ready for this upcoming year. And do you find, uh, we have just about 40 seconds left, but do you find that for players that focus on their own individual game, getting better as a team, to do the stuff in the community, like helping with these camps, really builds the teamwork aspect with them? Oh, definitely. And I said the definition of leadership is just not leading by example, but helping others lead. Okay. So being part of camps, you really get a chance to really be a part of a team, which to me, 
you have those friendships for life. And that's, that's what it's about. So you've grown up a sports fan, you're still doing this. Absolutely. And this is your passion. You got it. So we want to invite everyone to come out to these basketball camps to learn a lot more about than just about basketball, but also about life. For Cox 11, I'm Kevin Hornsby.